hi friends welcome to my channel and this is Citrix certification video training and this is the 13th video of in this series and today in this video I'm going to show you how installing virtual delivery agent on Windows Server OS so let's have some idea about my demo environment so in demo environment I'm using the same virtual machine which we have used in last video so we have three virtual machine first one is win 2 k 12 dc01 which is my active directory domain controller you can verify from here I have installed active directory DHCP on DNS role on this machine you can go ahead and see here my domain name my my DC name and the second machine is my delivery controller which is Citrix DC01 which is basically delivery control also I have installed all the core component on this machine Citrix Zen desktop core component you can say the store front director studio and I have also installed Zen Center here if you go and launch the Zen Center you can see the name of machine Citrix DC01 which is domain my domain and I have installed the R core components and Citrix Zen Studio, Zen Center as well as. And we have one server which is Zen Server 01, which is running Zen Server. And I have assigned 16 GB RAM to this machine. If you go here, you can see the Zen Server 01 which is running. And here you can see I have logged into Zen Center and I'm just going to connect my Zen Server 1 so put the credential here so now you can see I have connected with like uh, my Zen Center server which is Zen server 1 and let's proceed with the installation of uh, uh, like virtual delivery agent for Windows Server OS so in last video we have created this machine and we have installed the uh, all the required application which is like required for master image if you go yeah, let's see so press control at Dell to log in I have logged in with my domain account which is server admin on this uh, server machine which I am going to install a delivery agent so So you can see in last video we have installed MS Office 2016. Also we have installed few application like Adobe Reader, Note Plus Plus, and few other application like WinRAR and uh, Adobe Flash Player. These things. So, so the machine is ready for uh, like master for uh, master image. So I'm going to install now virtual delivery agent. So for the virtual delivery agent, we have to mount the installation CD of of Zen server Zen app so I'm going to mount the CD of Zen app and Zen desktop 7.11 on this machine let's go to the my computer so here you can see CD's map double click on it and it's now launching the Zen app and Zen desktop Installation window. So here we are. So let's click on Zen Desktop Delivery Application and and Desktops. So it will give you next window. So here you can see we have a prepare machine and image. So we have created basically prepared or uh, all the m all the settings on all the application on this machine. So we are going to prepare this machine. So install this agent. To delivery uh, to deliver the application and desktop from a server-based VM or physical machine. So I am using basically this machine is Windows Server 2012 R2 Data Center Edition. Here you can see. Also, this is running on a uh, like Zen server, so this is a virtual machine. So good to know. And go ahead and click on this, so it will launch the setup for delivery virtual delivery agent and if you are using any client version like Windows 7 and Windows 10 then you have to go for the like client version so we have here option uh, create a master image enable connection to uh, enable connection to s server machine so I'm going to create the like image master image so by using this we are going to uh, use basically machine creation services uh, provisioning services to create a server from master image so this is basically a master image so click next 
now we have a uh, uh, things which is required so if you want you can install the Citrix receiver um, basically the virtual delivery agent is required so let's install Citrix receiver as well as so click next and we have a here delivery controller so I, I'm going to mount my delivery controller which is Citrix DC01 so do it manually let's type the name so we have Citrix DC01 if it is connection okay we have to type the domain name as well as here so if you now test the connection it's passed so we can go ahead and add here so you can see it's added here do it manually so go to no click next now it's asking for few features which is required for the uh, like Zen desktop master image so windows remote desktop we have we have real time audio transport for audio and these all the settings basically so uh, so let's do default install the all the things together so click next and now we have here file word rules for our uh, agent so let's do it man automatically so the setup will create the inbound rule for these uh, these firewall ports so go ahead click next and now we have summary page here you can see wo installation directory and prerequests which need to be installed before running the setup and we have also here uh, core component which is like virtual agent virtual delivery agent Citrix and delivery controller name which we are going to this survey is going to report and features and the ports as well so let's click on install button so now you can see it's started one by one and it will install the all the prerequests one by one so during the during this NVIDIA installation machine require few reboots mostly two or three reboot to get the installation done so there was nothing we need to do it manually it will automatically restart the machine and it's automatically like uh, bring the machine online and let's execute the setup after rebooting the server so it's extracting file for dotnet 4.5.2 it will take some time now it's installing basically you can see dotnet framework it will take some time to get the installation done for dotnet so now machine need to restart installation is complete so go ahead and click close button it will restart the machine so here it's restarting So it's working on features, applying computer settings. So hit control to Dell and log into your server. Now it's running the setup again. You can see on desktop. So it's installing page again you can see your installation is started so it's now it's working on microsoft remote desktop session host so it will uh, might be re required restart one more time to enable the microsoft remote desktop connection and session host server so just wait for a few more minutes i'm pausing the recording for a few times uh, uh, within this installation because it's taking some time here you can see the again it's asking to reboot so go ahead and remove desktop session or install click close and it will take reboot now 
working on features so machine is rebooted now So getting windows ready, it will take some time to apply the changes. So again hit control tell tell and log into your same account. Oops, cancel this. Server admin and put the credential. So it's launching setup again. Initializing page is done. Now it's proceeding with the installation for Microsoft Windows Remote Desktop features, Remote Assistant features. So it's installing. So I'm pausing the recording here. If it's required any like manual interaction, then we will resume with the video from there. So Windows Remote as Assistant feature installation is completed. Now it's installing few Microsoft Visuals uh, runtime basically. So it's installing 2008, 10, and 13 all the runtime environment for uh, Microsoft Visual Studio. So it will take some time. So runtime installation for Visual Studio is almost done. Only 2010 X. 86 is left so it's installing now after this you can see so it's done and now it's installing virtual delivery agent basically so after this it will install a Citrix receiver then post installation then we are done with this setup only so pausing the recording again here so now you can see virtual delivery agent and Citrix receiver both installation is done and now it's doing the post installation like component initialization so it will take some few minutes to complete this task as well as so just waste for a few more minutes and I am pausing the recording here once the installation is done we will get back so call home finally it's it's I don't want to participate click next Please wait, it's initializing the background for us. So it's done. It's recommended to restart your machine. So click on finish. So it will restart your machine. So So you are about to signing, it's now restarting. So this is all about the installing the virtual delivery agent for Windows or Server OS. So thank you for watching and please subscribe me for more videos. And if you have any query, any question related to this, please post me on my given mail IDs. Thank you once again. Bye bye.